Alrighty guys, so today we're doing an awesome little challenge here with some axe spray. Um <coughs> the stuff you spray on yourself to make you smell like fish attractant. What I'm gonna do today is I'm going to be testing out um this axe spray here on some uh, soft plastic lures. Not necessarily this lure, um I might use this uh, little brush hog bait here from net bait, a little bait. Um but I'm telling you what man, this stuff, mm, it's gonna make those fish go crazy, I can guarantee it. This video is not sponsored by Axe, um, uh, not at all. Um, I wouldn't recommend doing this unless you want to smell like a, I don't know, like a, like a Macy's for the rest of your day. But in that, uh, in that case, so let's say you're done eating at a fancy restaurant. This is okay. Let me lower the eye. So it's a little too low, isn't it? Okay, so let's say you're done eating at a fancy restaurant and uh, you see this, this absolutely stellar fire, blue fire, ditch panda looking slaunch habitat pond behind the restaurant. And you're like, so, and you're in there, you know, you go, you'll spray yourself with some axe here. And then you're like, man, I want to catch some fish, but I have axe all over my hands. And, and if I touch this fishing lure, the axe is going to get on the fishing lure and make the fishing lure smell like axe. And, and fish don't like axe. Well, not necessarily. I mean, I don't know. We're going to find out in this video. But it should be pretty neat to see how the fish react to, uh, react to this. So far, I've never seen a challenge. And it's kind of a stupid challenge. But, you know, I, I had nothing, but nothing better to do today. So I thought I'd give this a little whirl here. Um, uh, if you guys want to see more challenge videos, let me know. And one more thing, since we did reach uh, our like goal on the pond video, I will be making more pond videos and creek videos uh, to catch fish for the pond and the tank. So yeah, let's get rolling to the pond and film some dope axe b-roll. So what I've got here is basically a finesse Carolina rig. Uh, we had a front roll through about early la early last week, middle this week still. Um, the birdie, bird blue skies or clear, whatever you want to call them, uh, bluebird skies. So I got the axe spray right here. Got my little uh, little brush hog dude, and we'll just douse it. There we go. See what that does for us. See if axe spray can catch a ditch donkey. I mean, it, it has to. So I've got a one six ounce tungsten weight, uh, basically on a finesse Carolina rig. I'm gonna toss it right in front of that drain over there. Oh my God, did you guys see the size of that fish? My dang, I don't know if you guys seen that one. That was a freaking, that was a real ditch donkey. That was about a four and a half, five pounder. Not using the best color, I'm using green pumpkin, but this thing has a freaking ton of vibration. Puts off tons. Oh my god! God dang it! Freaking, that was the same, he just ripped this, he just absolutely demolished my brush hog. Dude! He took me into that, there's a tree branch down there. Oh my god! Let's put some more axe on this and throw it back out there. Holy Jesus. God. He didn't get hooked, so he doesn't he doesn't know what wait, where'd my weight go? Oh my weight's all the way down here. Oh, 
six hours later. All right, I think there's one sitting up in here. I almost hit myself. What am I doing? Come on. I know. We got one. There we go. We got one. On the axe sprayed. We got one on the axe sprayed. The axe sprayed a mad pack of brush hog. Bring him up onto the bank. Bring him up onto the bank. Oh, we done did it, folks. We done did it. Ooh, look at this fish. We done caught him on the, on the uh, what is it called? Axe. We caught it on the, on the axe sprayed uh, the brush McGee. Oh my goodness, guys. Finally, after th three missed fish, we finally caught one. Not the biggest fish ever, not the most colorful fish ever, but we caught one. We caught a, this fish, he liked that axe spray so much, he decided to entirely eat the brush hog. And, and you know what happened? I caught him on the axe spray. Yeah, thank you so much, buddy, and I'll see you later, dude. Hey, I'm not D Almighty, so don't comment that, please. Three days later. Guys, so I'm gonna give the frog a shot here. I'm gonna douse this thing with axe. Like, I mean, douse. Douse the line, too. See what happens. I mean, let me smell this thing. This smells like straight axe. I mean, what else would it smell like? We're gonna re douse our frog here. Frog is doused. It's right down yonder over here, past the Dixie grass and to the left. Kill it. Kill it. Oh, you see that little blow up? Yeah, a little blow up, blow up in the grass. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. He ate the frog. Oh my gosh. He killed that thing. Look at that. That frog is gone. That axe sprayed lunker hunt frog is just demolished. Second fish. This fish is a uh, has some shoulders on it. Let's uh he's not big enough to eat the axe can. No, he's not even close. Maybe triple his size, but he he wanted the, the axe sprayed frog. Still smells like axe. Wow. Um, all right. Let's get a good little release on this guy. He came back for it twice. I kind of knocked him up onto the bank. We're going to toss him out there. Hey there, buddy. It's a little bit shallow right there. Yeah, I was just burning it across the water. Then I you know, just paused it right on the weed line. And he wanted it. So let's respray this dude. These fish have not experienced the uh, sheer power of the axe frog. There we go. Ah, another fish on the axe frog. Another fish on the axe frog. Can you believe that? Wow, wow, I hooked him. Dude, this fish was not coming off. This is our third fish today on an axe sprayed lure. Second one on an axe sprayed frog. Decent little dude, we'll let him go back on the same side. Hello, buddy. And I'm gonna say this every time I catch a fish on that side, they have the option to swim through these rocks. There's holes in the rocks. When it rains, the water comes over the rocks, so they're not trapped on that side. So don't get all, don't get worried, guys. What are you doing in my swamp? What? 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 are you doing in my swamp?
Oh, another fish in the axe braid frog. Another one on the axe sprayed frog. Not a very big one, but it's a fish. Look at that. I mean, these guys are just loving that axe sprayed frog. I'm telling you what. You guys go find some axe on sale. You catch yourselves fish. I'm telling you what, guys. Nice little axe fish. Make him do a backflip. Here you go, buddy. Oh, she came off again. So we're missing fish now. These fish are spitting it out. They're like, man, there's not enough ax on there. So we got to put more ax on there. This frog is just in a knot. Oh, there we got another one. This one's not coming off. I didn't even set the hook on that one. I just started reeling when she hit it. Because I was already straight retrieving, she just took it right on under. Look at that, guys. What is this? Our fourth, fifth axe fish? Not very big. Maybe the axe scent is the cure, uh, the axe uh, body spray is the key to catching numbers, but it's not seem to be producing the uh, double digits. All right. Little dinker dude, we'll let this guy go on this side.